Hello good people, this is Fisher12 and we have another exciting episode of the Black Ops show for you guys today as always and during the Gamescon reveal for Black Ops 3, Treyarch announced a new partnership with Nvidia to optimize their game for PC. Treyarch also posted a blog on their site outlining some of the key features for the PC version, so I wanted to briefly share those with you guys today. First, and probably the most important feature which will make us console users very jealous, is ranked and dedicated servers. Treyarch promised 100% on dedicated servers for PC, and after asking for them for the last, you know, three plus years, they are finally coming. We all know how important dedicated servers are to a game like Call of Duty with the host advantage, but host advantage is being taken out completely for the PC version, and that is excellent. Treyarch is also adding a two-player split-screen mode. That's also a pretty big addition in my opinion. That's something that you think would be in the the PC version of Call of Duty because we have it on the console version, but we don't. That's something that's brand new to the PC version. And you can split it horizontally, you can split it vertically, or you can even split it across two screens, which is really cool. There's also an improved text chat, which works now both in-game and in pre-game lobbies. There's also game controller support as well, and they're also incorporating some aesthetic changes too, like the ability to adjust the field of view and the frame rate cap, and they're also reworking the GPU scaling to support full 4K resolution as well. And of course, with the release of Windows 10, that will be supported for Black Ops 3 too. Treyarch also revealed their projected minimum specs, which I think is rare for developers to do before a game is released. Usually when a game is released is when they say these are the specs that will work for this game, but Treyarch is being a trailblazer in this area and saying this is what we are projecting will be the minimum specs for our game. But those are some of the most important details that Treyarch released about the PC version of this game. They said that there is more to come as we get closer to the reveal date, but I think it's good of Treyarch that they are trying to at least so, so show some attention to the PC version of the game and not leaving them in the dust, which they developers have tend to do with previous Call of Duties. You know, they tell the PC guys, oh yeah, we're going to address you, we're going to help you out, this, that, and the other thing, and then it never happens. So I think it, you know, give Treyarch a pat on the back that they're addressing these things before the game is even launched. And that will unfortunately bring us to the end of today's episode. So like and share the video if you enjoyed it, and make sure to subscribe to the channel if this is your first time here. For even more Black Ops 3 content, I have tons of more videos lined up for you guys because I am so hyped about this game coming out. But other than that, guys, hope you enjoyed the video, and take care.